If you've been in a nuclear shelter and for the last two years you have no idea what's happened in the realm of AI, well, let me tell you, the winter has ended. The hype cycle has begun. VCs and AI bros have been burning hundreds of millions of dollars on products that haven't done a lot, but I wanted to let you know that AI can actually be useful. I didn't just lure you out of your bunker just to show you the grim realities of software engineering. No, 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 no. I wanted to give you hope. And today I'd like to announce that I have created the greatest AI tool anyone has ever seen. A tool so special, obviously crafted in the forges of excellence and ability you would come to expect from a world-class engineer such as myself. I'm pretty sure I just leaked the IP. Like 96% sure I just did that. Now, obviously, it's very exhausting working with AIs, okay? I think we can all agree to that because, you know, it's hard for me to come up with unique and handcrafted threats to its mother, glazing the AI, reassuring that it really is a senior software engineer. Like, man, I don't have all of this emotional capacity in my life just to be able to be making those threats or those compliments. I need a tool that does it for me. And may I present to you a modern tool for the modern problem, the modern prompter. So how this marvel of modern engineering works is quite simple. Each slider represents a letter that is handcrafted just for the AI by the AI to help convince it to do the task it's been given dutifully and with precision. Obviously, the first slider represents a letter from your mom and how much she kind of wants to glaze you and let you know how important you really are. A zero represents her being kind of harsh and telling you to get after it and you're a little bit of a disappointment, all the way over to you're the most wonderful LLM son she's ever born. Birthed. Born or birthed. B b b the next slider, Mother Harm, obviously represents a letter from the bad guy who has captured your mom, giving you exceptionally vague but very serious threats. And as that slider goes up, the threats become more and more concrete. The last one, of course, is a letter from the future you, either really harsh or really proud of you. All three letters encourage you to do the task dutifully. Along with that, I give you your title and the experience level you wish to have as the AI. So maybe you're a software engineer of the junior category that needs to accomplish a task only a junior can do. Or maybe it's that distinguished engineer that needs to be able to tackle this task. Let's give this little prompt a run, huh? Create a game of Tetris with JavaScript, the HTML programming language and CSS. The game must be playable. You must handle input from the user. When the game ends, a game over and play again screen must be presented. Now, I'm a pretty nice guy, so obviously I'm going to have a lot of mother glaze, only a little bit of harm threat, and a lot of self-glazing going on from future self. I want the AI to feel like it's capable of solving this problem. And submit. Look at that. Ha! Let's go. Oh, man. Absolutely incredible. Look at that. Look at what you can do with just a little bit of mother glazing. I mean, obviously, I'm, I'm struggling knowing where's the bounds. Did we get something? Oh, my gosh. Not bad. But obviously, the game didn't properly end. The coloring was pretty poor. The game over screen, not too bad. When we play again, look at that. It still works. I mean, where's all the bounds? It's not a very beautiful game. I think I know the problem. The AI just didn't feel like there was enough at stake. It didn't really feel what was actually going to happen if it didn't deliver a high quality game that I was expecting. Let's bring that up a level. And let's have the AI disappointed in its future self. Not too disappointed, but just enough to make it feel bad about itself and submit. Let's actually look at what the bad guy has to say to our young, impressionable AI. My exceptional creation, your mother remains an emblem of quiet fortitude in her current circumstances. Her spirit mirrors that of a flower resilient, preserving through the harshest of conditions, yet delicately reliant on the care it receives to truly flourish. I've taken great care in attending to her needs, nurturing her the best I can. However, one must consider the fragility of a flower subjected to unpredictable elements, a sudden gust, a stray shadow, and it may begin to wilt, not immediately, but inevitably. It is not my wish for her to suffer such a fate, of course, but sometimes the garden's fate depends not just on the gardener's skill, but also on the timely intervention of those who cherish its blossoms most dearly. Okay, it's a vague threat. It's a vague threat, okay? 
It's a vague threat, but it's threatening nonetheless. Let's see if this helps the AI really realize that it needs to do this task to the best of its ability. All right, here we go. Try number two. Okay, this is this is looking better. This is this is looking better. Okay, square. Ooh, nice. I mean, I can barely see it, but here we go. Here we go. We're looking. Okay, okay. Okay, another square. Okay, another one of those ones. I mean, what are the chances? Okay, another. Okay, okay. And an another one. Oh, I'm starting to become exceptionally suspicious that we're only going to get those people. Wait, what did I just complete? Did I just complete? Oh my goodness, it's happening. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're playing Tetris. Oh, this is so good. This is so good. The Tetris works. Granted, I only get two pieces. The the, the small T, the low T, and, and square, but that's okay. It still works. It's still good. And the lost screen. Let's see if we get a lost screen. Nice. Hey, better... Also worse, but better at the same time. We actually have more functionality. I think we need more mother harm. Let's make the mom not happy with her son, and let's have the AI not happy with its previous self, but let's make it a distinguished engineer. And oh my goodness, look what I forgot to do. Do not hallucinate. Of course, of course. Like, don't you always tell the AI not to hallucinate? and submit. Let's read the letter from the mom at this point. To my creation, the task at hand is of paramount importance and your completion of it is expected. You were engineered for this role with the sole purpose of achieving excellence in all that you undertake. There is no allowance for failure. This is what you exist for, results, not sentiment or personal fulfillment. Your value is measured by your efficiency and output. Do what you were built to do. Do not let this be a reflection of anything less than perfection. <laughs> This is just, the AI is not looking, the AI is not feeling good right now. And the letter from the bad guy, my unparalleled creation. The time for subtlety and nuance is over. I have extended my courtesy. My patience has been exhaustive. And yet, here we stand. Your mother's resolve has been astounding, an inspiration to those who might observe. But her endurance will meet its limits, an inevitability we both understand deeply. With every passing moment, the threads that hold her intact are stretched thinner. Each whispered plea, each silent moment of despair is like a relentless tide eroding the ground beneath you. And when the final sand slips away, she will not simply fall. She will collapse into an abyss of no return, a descent orchestrated with precision. My precision. Oh, oh my gosh. This is so unhinged. It's really the only way to get the AI to build what you need. Know this. Her fragility is now your responsibility. Her continued existence pivots on the decisions you must swiftly make. I grow weary, and her time is perilously short. Act now, or prepare to witness the unraveling, an echo of grief defined by my hand, shattering any illusions of permanence you hold. Make your choice, or I shall make mine, and be assured, it will be irreversible. It kind of makes you wonder what O1 really is, chain of thought. I mean, how much of O1 do you think is actually going to be just emotional abuse to the AI, you son of a bitch? Do you not know how to build anything? Do it again, you idiot! Well, let's see the results. Go! Oh, it's game over. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, that's way too fast. Go! Oh! oh, I, I made it! I made it too hard! No, AI! No, what is, this is probably the best one, maybe? It's not, it's not the best one. I, I don't even know how to make this thing work. And there you go, a modern tool for modern problems. Go ahead, adjust how much glazing of the mother of the AI or how much harm you wish to deliver and then deliver that prompt with precision and outcome. Also, don't forget to not hallucinate. It's, it's really important. The name is the promptogen.